Hey YouTube, I just wanted to come on and share um, one of my new purchases from Amazon recently. I know there's a lot of ladies out there that love um, Louis Vuitton bags like me and are obsessed with the Speedy. Um, and I watch all those videos and I thought I would share um, this bag because I was interested in it and it really sparked my interest. Um, and I got it and I wanted to share with you my thoughts um, and if it's worth it or not um, because it's so um, crazy how much the real speedies cost and how they go up every year. Um, and I have to share that um, I have, um, I used to own, um, I've owned three real speedies um, in the past. I don't currently own a real one because in the past I've I've owned them, I purchased them, um, two of them brand new, and then the other one pre-owned, um, but then I ended up selling them, um, and I, it was years ago, and I stopped using it, so I was like, it's just sitting there, it's so expensive, I ended up selling it, um, and so now, and now I just can't afford the real one, it is so expensive, um, and don't wanna spend my money on that kind of thing, but I love the style. I think that I share that with lots of people, love the style of the Speedy and just the bag in general. So I went um, on YouTube and found, came across, um, I think, Shelby's uh, videos and she purchased this bag and I watched it and I was really interested to see what it really was like in real life um, because it is a Louis Vuitton dupe. It is not a replica. It is a dupe because it does not have any of the logos on the bag um, and they sell these on YouTube right now. I purchased mine from the company um, what is it called? Now it's slipping my mind. Um, something port I'll try to put it in the comments below, um, but they still have them right now, and I just got mine in yesterday. It was super fast shipping because I do have Prime, but it is the Damier Ebony dupe to the Louis Vuitton Speedy, the Speedy 30, and here it is, um, y'all, and I will have to say I've I've owned this exact bag, um, the real one. I, I did not have the bandolier. This one is the bandolier. It comes with the strap. I did not have the bandolier. I just had the regular Speedy 30. Um, and um, I owned this Demier Avene print. Um, and so I used to have a real one. And it was brand new from the Louis Vuitton store. And I am so impressed with this $36 bag. Like super impressed. I owned the real one in the past. It was years ago, but I, I remember it. Um, I was really, I've always been really obsessed with Louis Vuitton bags. So I, I do know lots of details to these bags and what they're supposed to look like, what they're not supposed to look like. And I am super impressed with this bag for $36. I can't believe it only costed $36 and they're able to make, um, this dupe look so much like the real one. It is amazing. I'm obsessed with this bag. Um, I want it in the azure print. I probably would not get it in the um, flower print, which is replicating the um, Louis Vuitton um, LV brown one uh, monogram. I probably wouldn't get that one, the dupe version, just because I don't care for the the flower print um but i do want the azure one now i want to try that one out now that one has the light um trim handles and i don't know if they change color if they're going to stay that light but it is pretty and i think i would use it in the summer so um this is the louis vuitton dupe it is not real it does not have any of the uh, logos on it and i got this from Amazon Prime. I got it in just a couple days. It was so fast. Um, so no logos on the front or any Louis Vuitton stamping on it. It is a dupe. It's just meant to give you the style and the look of the bag, but it is spot on. Like the dimensions, the canvas quality is beautiful. Like it has um, such a nice thicker texture. I was expecting this to be really flimsy and thin, the canvas, but it's not. Um, it's almost like, why would you want to spend almost $2,000 when you can have this for $36? And my thoughts are, um, if this starts to fall apart in five or six months after using it, 
I don't think I would mind spending another $36 to buy a new one. That's just my thoughts. And um, I love the style. Again, it's a beautiful color. Um, the company sent me, this came with the bag, this cute little, uh, what are they called? Twill lilies or uh, twillies. And it's just like a little mini bag scarf and I tied it on there. It is so precious. I, the handles are so pretty. It's a beautiful chocolate brand. They're very sturdy. Um, I cannot even believe the stitching on this bag is, is beautiful. Um, hopefully you could see that. The hardware is so pretty. I love the little, um, I love these shiny gold zippers. I don't know. Um, I don't remember because I didn't have the bandolier one. So the zippers on my regular one were a lot different than this, but I love these shiny ones. I think it looks really nice. The zipper, I was expecting the zipper to be like getting stuck. It's so smooth and you do get a double zipper. So you have one on this side and one on this side and it, um, does come with a um, a little lock inside. I probably won't use it. It doesn't have anything on the lock, um, but this bag is gorgeous. I'm going to show you on. I'm 5'4". I'll show you what it looks like on. Here we go. It is so pretty. I do have things inside of it. Um, it does come folded, but I'm surprised that some people have said that I watched their video that it had a big indentions. Mine has pretty much come out. Um, I don't mind it at all because the real ones do come um, indent like folded like that. But this one is it's gorgeous. It is so pretty. I'm by four. Let me move my chair back and I'm gonna show you um, the inside. So the inside is a little different, um, it, but it's really soft. I think the inside is softer than the real one. Um, it has a beautiful brown lining and it almost feels like suede. It's super soft. I love it. I have um, all my stuff in here and I'll show you what I have in there and I still have lots of room. Um, it does have a little zipper pocket and behind the zipper pocket you do have a little d-ring i don't think i'll use that just because it's behind the pocket um and so there is a little um zipper here and this one the zipper is pretty smooth and then the inside um let's see i have some business cards in there um so my work keys and then it does come with this little shiny lock nothing on it it's just a shiny gold lock and then it comes with this little key so the key does not have um anything on it like a little um loop or anything so they just come separately like this and i did find that the lock is a bit hard to open um you kind of this little thing is it's bigger there than this little thing and doesn't really open it easily so it's cute um but i don't think i'll be using that but you could use it if you wanted to um and then i'll show you i have a little pouch i have my wallet organizer this is my wallet organizer it's pretty thick um a hair clip a scrunchie my um, ring keys and this is just a piece of paper let's see I think that's oh I do also have my other little pouch so I have two pouches in there and then pepper spray and that's about it so it does come with a strap and the strap has a little um, turn turning clip there on both sides and then it is adjustable and the inside is just very simple uh, brown, but it has a nice suede lining. Um, if I put the strap on, I could wear it crossbody. But again, the Speedy for me is um, a handheld bag because it's so thick. It's not something I would wear crossbody all the time, but if you know I was out and about and needed my hands, um, I definitely could use um, the strap here. So I'm 5'4". It's just really thick. 
I think. And it is adjustable. I could wear it like this too if I needed to. Um, but yes, I am obsessed with this bag and I could not believe the quality of it. I will put the seller down below. If you are on the fence for $36, I say get it. It is a beautiful bag. I will be rocking it all um, all through this winter and um, possibly excited to try the uh, Azure print. So um, I've heard the color on that one is a little bit off, but, um, but I'd be willing to try it. I do have the Daisy Rose um, Azure print bag and um, could not get a hold of the brown uh, print in Daisy Rose for the tote bag that is a dupe of the Neverfull. Um, so they were sold out and I just couldn't get a hold of it, but maybe soon I'll try to get that one. But I will do some more videos on these bags if you're interested. I'm going to try out a couple others and I will post um, the, the seller below if you're interested in trying this bag it is beautiful so thanks for watching and i do have a video on the daisy rose bag i got on my channel so take a look at that one um thanks for watching bye